guys welcome to my channel this is Tuna scalper on it again today i will be teaching you guys how to calculate your lot size how to calculate your pips how to set your take profit how to set your stop loss especially for those who are using uh, who will be trading volatility markets so i advise you to listen to this video and listen to it to the end watch it to the end it's very important because i'm, I'm going i'm going to make sure that you enjoy everything i made the, uh, the story are more educative and uh, understanding and without wasting much of our time we have to start at once uh, for those who are new to forex those who are forex who are just starting forex uh, please I want you to go to my playlist at Beginner's Guide. There's a place where there are so many things that you need to you need to know about forex. You don't just come and jump into forex. That's the reason why I want you to go there and understand everything. And for those that are going to be trading uh, synthetic indices and volatility markets, I made some videos there on on how to open account to delete on how to transfer your money from your Deriv account to and um, how to fund your account and many things that you, I think as a beginner you will need will be there just go there, come down and watch the video and you understand everything it's for free you can join my telegram channel using the link in the description so that you can be getting signal and also you will be dropping your own signal it's not it's not us i'll be giving you every time so it's just a community so now let us start first of all if you don't know how to make use of this mt5 go to my playlist too i made a video on it you can watch it and understand how to make use of your of, of the of this mt5 okay you can see my moving average for those who don't know what is moving average i made a video about indicators so you can understand everything on and the best indicator that will be good for you is there so now let us start uh, let us place a, let us just place a market so first of all let us mark where our profit will be and where our stop loss will be. This market, let us say that this market is going up, so we want to buy. So if we are buying, we have to have a stop loss and the stop loss should be somewhere under. Then if you are selling, that means your stop loss should be at the top. So let's say that our stop loss will be here. This and hey make sure you are writing everything down you write down your stop loss you write down your take profits make sure then our stop loss there is six five four six six five four six point six nine eight that is our stop loss then let us put our take profit here our tp TP to be what six six zero zero point six three three. That will be our TP. So now let us go and place the trade. There is no time to waste. Stop loss. What is our stop loss? Our stop loss is six five four six points. Six nine eight. Then our take profit will now be six six zero zero point six six three. So we are buying. You go to lot size. The minimum lot size here. If you say, if you press zero point one, it will not go. That means. Uh, it is too low 0 0.2 not possible 0 0.3 it 
0.3 was able to enter. That means the minimum loss size here is 0.3. The minimum loss size is 0.3. As a beginner, I will advise you don't don't use a very big loss size. Use a, use small loss size so I will not end up blowing your account. I have advice for all the beginners in the forest market. You can go to my playlist there. There are advice for you. You read them and understand so that you don't enter the market and start making mistakes. So, say we are buying. You now press buy. It's loading. It's loading. Just be patient. Done. The market, the buying, the buy order has been executed. You can see now we are in, we are making some loss. The, the this is zero point, uh, zero point. You can see we are we are now in profit. So now let us go and check. That is how to place trade. Then. If you now come here, you will now see how it is moving. If this market move, moves from here to here, that means the market is in our favor. It will take profit automatically. But if the market moves from here to here, that means we are in loss. What that implies that the market will kick us out with loss but if you the upper one it will kick us out with profit that is how to place trade in in a, for those that are trading indices that's how to place the trade then if you go to trade you see balance balance is nine nine thousand four hundred and twenty four dollars nine thousand four hundred and twenty four dollars point two zero cents this thing implies that that's the price before the trade then equity equity is nine four two four nine thousand four hundred and twenty four dollars this is just the price as the trade is running because if it's it is only equity that changes it's only equity that the price varies in equity the price can go up and go down equity shows you the particular amount of money you have at a particular time of that trade for example now if i'm making profit now if i'm making profit now my balance will not shake it will remain the way it is then the equity will be the one that will be increasing and be reducing Yes, that is how it works. Then the margin and the free margin and the margin level. That's how all of them works. Then in history is where like this is uh, these are the trades that are placed within this period of time. The one I have won and the one I have lost, all of them are here. So it's giving you history of all the trades you have been placing within the uh, within the time being within the week or so. So the one here is the calendar. We, they have the calendar there. The calendar also help you to know the, the calendar. This is the calendar. It will now help you to know the time at which you are placing the trade and the time at which. Uh, very simple. So, with this point, I believe that you can now go to your to your to your account and place your trade with full chest without anybody pressuring you. I, I hope you learned a lot from this video that I've, I've made. Please like and subscribe to my channel for more videos. You can as well go to my playlist and see more videos on eh, on how to calculate stop loss. Due to time, we are in a hurry now. Due to time, please go to go to what is it called? Go to my Go to my playlist and watch how to calculate pips in volatility markets and, and uh, volatility market and synthetic indices. Please go to my playlist and watch it. Due to time, I'm going to stop here so that I won't make I won't be wasting much of the time because the more we waste time, the more it becomes boring. 
subscribe to my channel and thank you so much for your time bye